Alrighty, so um, it seems every week or every day now, Cedar Point is buying up more property in the Sandusky area. Lots of people are curious about what could be going on, and I honestly think this is a really easy case to solve. The Point, the actual Cedar Point property, the peninsula, is running out of room. So what better way to fix this problem than removing property on the peninsula that they don't necessarily need to make way for future attractions or better fitted um, areas that could benefit the park, like a hotel um, or other options. Like it could be anything. It could be a restaurant going there. It could be a uh, low grade hotel maybe even, um, or it could be an attraction, whether that be a dark ride or a show building. Anything could happen in these areas that are being removed. So everyone already knows, I don't need to go over it. These buildings here are being bulldozed and removed right now. Um, and Cedar Point is buying property off of property. Um, and the location is very interesting. So they bought a motel um, and I'm gonna be honest, it's, it's pretty obvious what the motel will probably be used for. They just removed a bunch of dorms. We haven't seen any new dorms go up. So I think they're gonna use the motel right now to house some of the Cedar Point residents, um, the workers during the season. Um, they bought property that uh, we don't know what they're doing with it yet as well. So we're, we might see some offices be moved off site from what I've read on um, some new sites online. They're saying that they, they're looking into moving some HR buildings off site. We haven't seen any signs of that yet. Um, so this is the area that I believe some of those buildings like maintenance and HR. I have a feeling down the road, we could see those being moved off of property to make way for an amazing attraction in the area. In fact, the ones we just showcased right there would make a great home for a roller coaster of some sort. Um, the area that the uh, the red kind of dorms were shown, I'm not sure if a roller coaster would fit in there unless it was something like an infinity or a spinning coaster or an attraction like a show building dark ride of some sort and they somehow bridged it over the road. Although I, I think that's a little unlikely. It'd be weird to see what they do with that plot of land that they're removing the dorms on. Maybe they're just gonna build better dorms because those dorms have received pretty bad reviews online. Now, the peninsula has a large road with lots of property that Cedar Point could build dorms on. Um, I know they don't own the entire peninsula, including the roadway, causeway, um, but they do own some of that on the way up. Now, talking about the motels so right there, the budget something in <laughs> um, is what they purchased. And that's what I'm guessing where they'll have some Cedar Point um, employees while they currently remove some of those dorms. Um, right down there below it, the giant parking lot, the two giant parking lots, I believe they also own now as well. You can correct me down below if I'm wrong, but I believe they own those two. Um, so again, uh, definitely think there's nothing major going on like attraction wise, obviously this far away from the park. I think they're gonna be moving a lot of things off site. Cedar Point needs as much room as possible on that peninsula for future development. They're trying to become that destination park and draw in more guests. Obviously Cedar Point is reaching for the 4 million category at this moment and they're just standing still and they need that extra oomph. So we're gonna see that develop probably over the next couple of years. Now see these white buildings just off to the top left of the screen now in the center? That I know Cedar Point did purchase, so they've purchased that as well. Um, and I'm not quite sure, I could be wrong, I think the buildings have come down um, as of yet, but no development has started. Um, either there's been no development at all or the buildings have come down and no development after that. Um, but regardless, it's all very exciting. Um, definitely just trying to move things off property for future developments. There's nothing weird. There's nothing like super epic going on quite yet. Um, it ha probably has nothing to do with 2021 or 2020. Um, it, they're probably, this is probably for attractions five to 10 years from now that they're doing all this. It's gonna be a lot of work moving forward. Anyways, hope you enjoyed this update on my thoughts on the matter. Um, don't forget to subscribe if you haven't, like the video, if, um, and share this video for others to enjoy. Thanks so much for watching, guys. Have a good one. Bye.